Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to Technology Explorer. My name is Usman Chaudhary and in this video I am going to make this part by using this drawing. So most complicated portion of this drawing is making uh, this part of the uh, project. So keep watching this video till end and if you want to download this part for your practice or this drawing for your practice I will leave the download link in the description of this video. So keep watching this video till end. Okay, let's start. Uh, first of all, make a print of this drawing and uh, then start from uh, top plane. First of all, I will start making sketch of uh, this uh, this part. So um, as you can see, this seems to be a rectangle. So draw a rectangle like this, like this. Press escape key and then uh, press and hold control key select the origin and this point make their relation uh, horizontal similarly make the horizontal relation uh, vertical relation for these two points now define by using smart dimensions this um, distance is 100 millimeter and this distance is uh, so as you can see we do not have um, the complete distance so we have to sum all these distances so uh, make the um, sum 100 so one zero zero plus 110 zero plus 100 zero zero. draw a line like this now I'm going to make this cut press and hold control key and uh, then select origin and this point make their relation vertical Define the distance, this distance, 12 millimeter. This distance is 110 millimeter. Now press escape key. Draw a center line and draw it like this. Press escape key. Use mirror entities, entities to mirror, click on this box and then select this, this and this. Mirror about, select this box and select this center line and press OK button. Now uh, select trim entities and trim this side, also this side. Now press escape key. Again define the distance, this distance 100 millimeter. So our sketch is now you can see fully defined. Now we have to extrude this uh, sketch. This is also 12 millimeter. Now I am going to make this uh, ring, we have to click on front plane. So sketch on it, make normal to by, by pressing ctrl plus 8 key from your keyboard and draw two circles, one circle and another circle. Now define the uh, diameter of the outer circle, 150 millimeter and the diameter of inner circle. 75 millimeter. Press escape key and select origin and this center point. Make the relation vertical. Again, uh, define the distance from the center of the circle up to the bottom of this part. It is 220 millimeter. So, as you can see, our sketch is once again fully defined. Now we have to extrude it. Uh, go to features and select extrude extruded both base command and make sure that uh, from here drop down this option and select mid plane now define the width of this ring 50 millimeter so now we have to make four holes on in this ring so uh, for that first read the drawing carefully so uh, it's written 12 deep which means 12 mm uh, in depth on 105 PCD which means the circular diameter of the uh, holes is 105 millimeter uh, four holes definitely number of holes uh, is four and six tap which means uh, six m6 threads so what I'm going to do I'm going to use uh, this whole wizard command scroll down and from here select this straight tab uh, option then again scroll down 
from here on size option drop down this option and then select m6 here is the depth type here 12 as they were uh, 12 deep then click on this tab positions then select this face press ctrl plus 8 key from your keyboard and then select circle draw it like this from here select construction geometry for construction now define the diameter of this circle one zero five and then draw another center line like this one more center line started from the center point up to this quadrant point press escape key now define the angle 45 as on the drawing there is not mentioned uh, this angle but it seems to be that this angle is 45 degree so make this uh, line also construction geometry and then drop a point on this point so now press escape key and then press this button so now we have to make a circular pattern for this um, hole for that click on this arrow below the linear pattern command and select circular pattern click on this axis box here and select this circle also select this features to pattern box and then drop down or expand the uh, uh, parts tree and select m6 tab hole type here quantity 4 and make sure that this equal spacing option is checked and then press ok button now i am going to make this part um, this seems to be a difficult part of this drawing so there are number of uh, ways to make this part for me uh, what i am going to do i am going to make uh, another plane like this so for that first of all i have to sketch on front plane make normal to and uh, then select a uh, center line and start it from here and uh, up to this quadrant point as you can see on the drawing so uh, now press escape key now define the distance from this line up to this point 35 millimeter so now draw another center line start it from this midpoint like this define the distance of this line this distance should be the um, thickness of this part which is 8 mm now press this button to save and exit from sketch mode now i'm going to make a new plane so for that click on reference geometry and then select plane first reference uh, select this line and for the second reference select this point so here is the plane press ok button to create this plane now click on this plane and sketch on it make normal to by pressing ctrl plus 8 key from your keyboard and then draw a sketch using line command like this press escape key now select this midpoint origin and this midpoint make their relation vertical draw a center line from this midpoint up to this point press escape key and make their relation horizontal now define this width 36 mm also define this width 
65 mm. Now draw another center line and start it from this point up to this point. Press escape key. Select this point and make it fixed. Now select this line and make it horizontal. So our sketch is now fully defined. Here you can see. Now I am going to extrude it. Go to features tab and select extrude it. Boss base command. Extrusion thickness is 8 mm. But in the opposite direction. So reverse the direction by clicking on this box. Press OK button. Select this sketch and hide it. Now I am going to uh, mirror this part on this side. So for that click on uh, mirror command here and uh, click on this box mirror face or plane. Drop down this menu and from here select right plane. For features to mirror select this uh, part and press OK button. Now I am going to make uh, this portion of the drawing. So for that click on this face and sketch on it. Make normal to and then uh, draw a sketch by using line command. Like this. Now draw a three point arc. Press escape key. Select uh, this line and this arc. Make their relation tangent. Also tangent relation for this line. Select the uh, this point, the center point and this point. Make their relation vertical. Now select the center point and the origin. Make their relation horizontal. Now define the width of uh, this line. So as in the drawing, uh, there is not mentioned the width of this line. But we can uh, assume this width. As you can see, this distance is 18 mm. So this is the radius. So the diameter should be 36 mm. And uh, uh, this arc is also a tangent to these lines. So we can assume that this width should be 36 mm. Now uh, distance from this line up to this center point is 18 mm. Change the shade and press escape key. Select this point and this line. Make the relation coincident. Now we can uh, again change the shade. Now go to features and extrude it up to 12 mm. Again, uh, we have to use mirror command and uh, in the mirror about we have to select right plane and for features we have to select this post extrude and press OK button. Now we have to make the hole. For that we, we have once again we have to use the hole wizard command and this time we have to make a um, simple hole. Drop, uh, scroll down. So we have to change the type from double holes to drill sizes. So now uh, scroll down, scroll down, and uh, here you can see 14 mm. So the end condition we have to select throughout or through all. Then uh, go to positions tab and select this space. Drop one hole on this center point and then drop one hole on this center point and press OK button. So next step is that we have to make uh, this portion of the drawing uh, in this part. So uh, first let's see drawing. So as you can see the distance uh, from this face up to the face of uh, this portion is 40 four mm. So uh, first we have to uh, measure the distance from this face up to the uh, front plane and this distance is 38 millimeter. 
so we need the distance for 0 mm so once again we have to make another plane which is 40 mm apart from this face so uh, type 40 mm and in the reverse direction so check this box flip offset and press ok button now sketch on this new plane make normal to by pressing control plus 8 key from your keyboard and then select this circle then select convert entities also select a line and draw a sketch like this press escape key now uh, draw a sketch like this Press escape key and now use trim entities and trim this side of the circle and also this side of the circle press escape key now select uh, this sketch fillet fillet radius is 15 mm select this and this corner press this uh, ok button again press ok button now select this line and this line make the relation parallel and then define the distance from this line up to this line 25 mm distance from this line up to this line 18 mm so our sketch is now fully defined now go to features tab and extrude this sketch on the opposite direction the extrusion thickness is 8 mm press ok button so this is how we can draw these type of um, parts in solid parts i hope you have enjoyed and learned from this video and if you have any suggestions please do comment below and uh, don't forget to subscribe this youtube channel for more uh, videos like this thanks for watching and sparing time